telling you guys right now, if you're in this room, you're one of the luckiest people alive. Who believes that? Raise your hand. Okay. Find value in your life. Fuck fear. I'd like to get paid. That's why I work every day. I'll be making money till I'm in my grave. Don't care what they say. I buy time with my money. Laughing to the bank. I swear to God, we're going to make a commitment to each other right now. And by the way, guys, I'm not better than all of you. You know what I did? I cracked the code. You know what the code is? You can have it all. That's the code. The code is, which will be the next slide, I'm going to give you some advice that's going to show you how to get it all. But I want to know, I don't care about your to-do list. I don't give a shit. I care about your priority list. What is important to you guys? If you were to die right now, you have 30 seconds left, what in the hell are you thinking about in the last 30 seconds of your life? Like, like, oh my God, like, who's going to watch my kids? Okay, that's your kids. Oh my God, who's going to take care of my wife? That's my wife. That's it. Stop. Hey, am I going to heaven? Jesus, forgive me for my sin. It's God then. So God, wife, kids. Does that make sense? Okay, you need to move that shit right to the front right now. And you need to say, God, I need to figure out how to get time and be closer with you. I'm going to stop breaking promises. Would you guys stay in a relationship with somebody that constantly lied to you? That's why you guys don't listen to yourself anymore. That's why you guys don't respect yourself anymore. You do what you do because of what you think about yourself. When you break promises, you guys say, I'm going to get up 5 o'clock and go to the gym. You hit that snooze button, you're hitting the snooze button on God, on your wife, and on your kids, on your business, and on yourself. You have no freaking idea. Listen, there was a salesman one time. He goes, dude, I'm supposed to make 100 calls a day, but I really make 90, and nobody knows. I said, bro, when you don't touch the line... When you play sports and you don't touch the line, the coach doesn't see you, but you know you didn't touch the line, you're not going to make it. You guys need to touch the line. You guys need to make sure that if you guys want to really build something beautiful, guys, is life beautiful? God, man. You know, this state that we're in in this room right now, this is the way that we should stay until we die. And if anybody is distracted right now, dude, I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry you were here and you're going to miss out on this. But for those of you that are with me, this is a conversation for the elite. This is not a conversation for the posers or those that came to take pictures on social media and go back and tell their buddies they went and trained. This is for the true warriors. Okay? So I'm just talking to you guys about who are really ready to go do something. Now, let's go, guys. Let's Hell go. yeah. The fucking winner. For the winners, baby, let's go! All right, now listen, security, here's my point. When you walk somebody, walk across the room, can you tell by the way they're walking, the way they're talking, if they believe in themselves, yes or no? Yeah, you can tell when somebody's all fucking poopy pants and shit, walking around. Listen, guys, here's your goal. I'm going to tell you this. My goal is I'm going to build up security inside of me on who I am. So I'm going to tell you what to do right now. Ready? Hey guys, what's going on? It's Andy. A lot of you leave comments Tell me that you need help. Do me a favor. I'm going to tell you the best way to get a hold of me. Shoot me a text message right now, 918-210-0254, 918-210-0254. I'll help you with whatever you need. I got your back for life. Let's get back to the video. There's four ways that you're going to learn. And by the way, like it starts now. Number one, we're going to go to the classroom. You're already here. So you go to a room that can teach you shit that'll make you better. Number two, you apply it. You have to apply it. What you don't apply, you're not gonna get better at. Learn, apply, learn, apply, learn, apply. Then number three, you're gonna find a mentor. Everybody write down on a piece of paper your mentor's name right now. Just, just quick, write it down. Who is it? I know you may got a couple, but write it down. Okay, number two, write down someone else that you've been viewing that you would like to start studying them and you want to get a little bit closer to them because it's intriguing. Maybe they have a style that could challenge you to reach for more. And I want you to start learning from them when you leave. Okay? Number four, you're going to start teaching. The fastest way to learn is to teach. Okay? Everything I learn, I immediately teach it to my team. It changes me. I change them. And then I want them to go change others. Does that make sense? You guys are all teachers. Everybody here is the trainer. Every freaking one of you here are the trainers. I'm going to tell you this, how you look. We're going to make a commitment in this room right now, and I'm going to sidetrack this for a second. 
but how do you look? If you're going to be an influencer, do people got to want to be like you? Yes or no? Okay. Do you guys want to be like somebody that takes care of themselves? Yes or no? Okay. Write down right now, I'm making a commitment today to get in the best elite shape of my life. My life was changed because of fitness. Not because of sales and closing. Yes, I got sharper. But when I started to get physically fit, I became a machine for learning. I saw a new man in the mirror. I brought home a new man to my wife and to my children. I brought home a new man to my team. And when I looked in the mirror, I thought I could close every deal. Delusional belief, like through the roof. I mean it. Dude, I didn't care if I was on the phone or in person. I was going to close anybody, anytime, anyplace, anywhere. I started to believe in me again. I don't care how old you are in this room. If you're 60 years old, if you're 16. There's a kid who was 16 back there. I said, damn, man, I wish I could have been in a room like this at 16. That's badass. I don't care how old you are. You need to put some more muscle on. You need to lean down. Listen, everything in your life that's going to change is going to be because of a decision. Would you agree? Everybody, your life you have now is because of the decisions you made five years ago, a year ago, and last week. Am I correct? And the decisions you make today will shape the future you have tomorrow. Okay, let's go over decision making 101. Just because I think that a lot of people don't know how to make decisions. And I'm not being a smart ass. So if I want to get healthy, cheeseburger, grilled chicken. Everybody in on grilled chicken? What if you ate a cheeseburger? That takes you away from where you want to go. Am I correct? That's how easy decision making is. L guys, listen to me. I was a bad person before. I did a lot of stupid shit. I don't deserve to be here with you guys. God has grace. And he's like, hey, dude, this crazy ass person, he's going to do something great. Uh, that's why I'm keeping him alive. I should probably be dead. I'm telling you guys right now, if you're in this room, you're one of the luckiest people alive. Who believes that? Raise your hand. Okay. Now, how fast can you change? I'm going to tell you what I believe in. You know what's good for you? Yes or no? You know what's good for you? Do you know what's good for you? Okay, do you need to get healthy? Yes or no? Okay, can you do it? Are you going to do it right now? Are you going to start in the gray shirt? Yes? Watch. I met these two last year at Closer School Live. Have no idea who they are. We had a conversation. By the way, I want to share this story with you. They bought tickets to go to the VIP event last year. They had like, sit, huh? He was sitting right here. They, they had six grand in their bank account and they spent every dollar to come here. They literally couldn't even pay their bills. Yeah, yeah give it up for them. You know what I'll tell you guys? Find value in your life, fuck fear. A lot of you guys, you get an opportunity to get so close to someone that can change your life, you do it. How much is it going to cost? More than you want to pay. Count me in. Hey, dude, I've had my whole life to get my, I've had my, whole, my whole life to get my life together. Okay? And if I feel like you're the one that can do it, I'm all in. What's it cost? These two made a decision. I didn't even sell them a ticket. She made the decision. She called him and goes, hey, I just spent our whole savings account. And I bought us two tickets to close our school life. By the way, listen, am I right? She's working at like a vet clinic or some shit. She doesn't even sell, okay? He's crawling under houses and closing people's on, on quotes. They're normal people and they thought like average people. You know what I saw? And I'm going to do the same thing with you guys and I want to see if you guys got the courage to do this. I met them and they walked up and they go, dude, your, 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 your conversation with us changed my life and we're ready to change. I said, okay. What did I ask you? What's your fucking problem? Yeah, no, 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 because I'm direct, right? So I asked him, what's your problem? And he goes, what do you mean? I go, what do you need to stop doing right now? And what'd you say? I smoke pot every day. Now, listen, how long has you been smoking weed? Our entire relationship. How long have you been telling him to stop smoking weed? Our entire relationship. <laughs> Maria, take the mic. Tell him what happened. So afterwards, whenever he told Andy what his problem was, Andy looked at him dead in the eye and said, you're going to stop. As of today, you're no longer going to smoke pot anymore. And Bryson committed to it. And since then, almost a year ago, Bryson has not picked up smoking pot again. So the problem here is most women would be jealous of that and be like, 
Maria could have told Bryson, I've been telling you our whole relationship to stop. And then this stranger over here tells you to stop, and then you stop. That's what happens. A lot of people get jealous when somebody's ready to change. The person that's close to us, instead of really supporting them to change, they hold them back. So, Maria, great job for <laughs> doing that. I mean, you know what? I say this all the time. When the student is ready, the teacher will appear. You feel me? And you know what happened? Bryson goes, I'm done. I don't even know him. Isn't that crazy how that shit works? It was a decision that he's probably been wanting to make his whole life, but he didn't have the freaking balls to do it, and he probably had fear instead of doing the right thing. And some of you know the right shit you need to be doing in your life. You want to make more money than ever? Swear to God. Closer School Live, to me, is about you becoming the elite motherfucker in every area of life and closing yourself on the life you deserve and actually taking action and getting it. And then you're gonna close everyone else on everything that you want because you freaking, you were sold on yourself. And by the way, I want you to get it all, okay? Now watch, watch this. Here's the crazy shit. You know what Bryson does? He changes, he stops. What else did I say? This one's for Brad Lee. What else did I tell you to do? Have sex every single day. Have sex every freaking day. I said, hey, how often you having sex? People are like, I can't believe you said that. You don't even know them. Shut up, dude. Hey. And they never stop smiling because of it. Yeah. And guess what? I said, from now on, you're going to have sex twice a day. You're going to stop smoking weed. You're going to go hit the gym all the time. And you're going to change. And you know what happened? We watched them from a distance for 60 days. Me and my wife, we watched them from a distance. And you know what happened? They freaking did what they said they were going to do. We were watching them transform online. And, and our team, we were like, dude, these are the badasses. So we hired Bryson. And Maria with, was, 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 was with Bryson. Now, she was doing real financial, which is selling insurance. And they're changing their life. Bryson, he, like, I don't even know if he knows how to sell shit, But I know he knows how to change. Does that make sense? You know what I do? You don't know how I hire? My team, the most elite team in the country, we can close anybody, anytime, any place, anywhere. I swear to God on the phone, we'll run more rev than anybody. Dude, we're freaking on fire all the time. I hire underdogs. Screw education. Screw your experience. I don't give a shit. Oh, you're a sales trainer? No ways. I want to go find somebody who don't know shit. You care about people? You got a good heart? Babe, does he got a good heart? She does her shit. And she's like, yep, he's got a good heart. Okay, she does that like, she's like the cartel leader. And then she's like, yep, he's got a good heart. And then I say, all right, are you coachable? If I say stop, can you stop? If I say start, can you start? If I say change, can you change? And they start doing it. You know what I say? Qualified. We're done, man. We're gonna teach you to be the baddest motherfucker in the country, the top 1%. Swear to God on my life, I'm gonna annihilate everybody's ass with you. And when you invest in people like that, that wanna make those choices, they'll die with you. They'll stay with you for life. Some of you, I'm with my, my wife till I die. Our team, we're together until we die. You know why? What else would I keep looking for if you found it? Nothing. This is a life by design. You guys are going to start creating a blueprint in your life that is everything you ever wanted, and you're gonna stop settling. Hey guys, I just wanna tell you, you're the true one percenters, you made it till the end of the video. Do me a favor, share it with the friend that wants to go to another level. Make sure you like the video, comment below so I know who you are. Set your notifications, and then subscribe to the channel. We got daily sales training videos dropping. I'll see you soon.